In this video, we will see how WebRV can be used to extract statistics of matches from Flashcore website. So first, let's load the Flashcore website within WebRV's configuration browser and go to a leak archives and suppose that we need to extract match details mainly statistics from all the matches of a previous season for example let's take 2018-19 so I click on it and go to the results so these are the 2018-19 results of all the matches now to scrape the match details from each of these matches would require a two-stage scraping process it's mainly because this does not have a link so the follow this link option is disabled which does not allow you to load the mass details page even in the html there is no url of the mass details page now you can actually use the open pop-up feature to open the mass details page but then since this page has show more matches that won't work because the moment you close the pop-up and come back all the loaded matches will go and only the default set will be displayed so we go for a two-stage scraping process in the first stage we get the id of all these matches using which we build the match details url and then we use a configuration to scrape all of them in one go so let's first go to settings and in advanced minor options let's change these values to two and one respectively click ok make sure that you reset these to the default values after mining this website and also enable the automatically remove duplicate records while mining. So apply the changes and start mining. I mean the start configuration. Let's select the first row of match. So select it completely like this. And if I select capture HTML, I can see that the ID of the match is present here. To extract that, we would need a regular expression, which is this. You can find this in the video description below. apply so this is the id of the match capture html id no let's scroll down and also configure pagination click on the show more matches link more options set as show more link so now i can stop configuration and start mining you can specify the number of pages here we mine only two pages start mine and we get the ids of all the matches let's wait for the data to appear So here is a list of IDs. So we need to copy this to a text editor. Just click on it, Control A, Control C, open the text editor, and just paste it. Now, how do we change these two URLs? For that, we just need to replace this G underscore one underscore, replace it with this you this string. So if I do a replace all so all these are match URLs now let's scrape all of them using a single configuration for that let me copy the first URL and load it within WebHavi and start configuration and then I add the remaining URLs to the configuration using the add URLs method so So I copy the remaining list here, apply. And now I can start selecting data. But before that, we need to perform a navigation. So for that, disable pattern detection first. Since we need to extract statistics, click on the statistics tab. This works for any data on this page. Click on it, the statistics page will load. Suppose we need to go to the first half, we can click on that too. And now, let's start selecting data now you can individually select the required data but here we can also use the pattern detection option to get all the stats data of the match so this would be the stat okay so this would be team one and team two we can also select the name of the teams and maybe also the final score.
All right. So now let's stop the configuration and start mining data. So the data for the first match has come up. The various stats and also the team one and team two name and final score, which comes in the last row. So Vibhavi has now proceeded to the second match and the stats of the second match will be pulled and displayed soon and so on. So we hope you find this video useful. If you have any questions, please feel free to mention in the comment section below or contact our support. Thank you.